Hello, I just thought I'd show you a project I've been working on. It's Doom running on a Nintendo Entertainment System. This is the full version of Doom with all of the levels and monsters etc. There's no cheating here either, this is a completely stock, unmodified console and the Doom cartridge will work on any other USA NES. Now, Doom needs 8 megabytes of RAM and a 32-bit 33 megahertz processor, and obviously that isn't going to run on the NES, which has 2 kilobytes of RAM and an 8-bit 2 megahertz processor, so there is some trickery going on here. So some of you might have guessed it, but I've hidden a Raspberry Pi inside the cartridge. Some people might consider that to be cheating, but it's no more cheating than the Super FX chip inside the SNES's Star Fox or the Sega Virtual Processor inside the Genesis's Virtua Racing. I got the idea from how choose Raspberry Pi case mod, which I'll link to below. Basically, Doom runs on the Pi and hijacks the NES's graphics memory bus to inject the Doom graphics straight onto the picture processing unit. It's somewhat similar to Sucker Pinch's idea, which I'll also link to below, but it uses a high-speed USB controller from Cypress Semiconductor to do the actual data transfer. This makes it a little bit more stable and gives it better graphics quality. You could in theory use this technique to port any game that will run on a Raspberry Pi to the NES, so perhaps I'll do Quake 3 next. Anyway, I still have to improve the graphics quality and work out a few bugs before I can release this project, but stay tuned for a guide on how to build your very own Doom cartridge.